Some critics said that there is a rapid deterioration of human rights in Hong Kong after the passage of the National Security Law. As a Hong Kong citizen, let me tell you, these accusations are completely groundless. The National Security Law never targets peaceful protesters and ordinary citizens, but only a very small minority of people who make very serious national security related offenses. Over the past eight months, less than a hundred of people have been arrested, and none of them is an ordinary protester. The legitimate right and freedoms guaranteed in the basic law are all protected. The human rights situation in Hong Kong is exactly the opposite to what the critics have described. Here at the Council, I believe you would agree to two basic principles. Number one, safeguarding national security through legislation is a must but not an option. Number two, the subordination of human rights to national security is unnecessary. Let me emphasize one last point. Hong Kong independence movement is illegal. We should all take a stand against it. A peaceful Hong Kong not only serves our interests, but also your interests and the common interests of the international community. Thank you. Thank you.